Okay, then I think we are uh, good to go again. Uh, let's see. Reset session statistics. And uh, yeah. Let's see how the morning rolls, what the morning brings, and how the teams are and stuff. First game, uh, Lakeville Standard Battle, Tier 8 game. Let's see what they got. They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 mobile tanks, 2 light tanks, and we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 as well, and 2 light tanks. So uh, <coughs> again, I'll go to this uh, spotting bush by the house by the lakeside. So let's uh, see if we can spot anything. So no art is spotted the room bomb. <coughs> Wasn't even spotted them. And let's see, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve things spotted. That guy is uh, camping behind a house. Spotted. <coughs> Seems like they haven't pushed into city yet, so I think we should be able to push up without a problem. Um,
But again, it's still only 4 1, so we have a, a really a lot of map control. I'm only 5 tanks uh, dying. Morning skid! Early up, I see. So they haven't managed to really. Uh, Push city in, uh, push valley in any kind of meaningful way. to get some more damage in. Uh, that was uh, <laughs> too much YOLO. <laughs> okay, so we did uh, close to 2.5 uh, combined, so that's a decent start actually. It's need to get some games to get in the into rhythm. Six hours uh, is a little bit, a little bit too little for me. I need like seven, seven and a half, I think, then I'm really good. I can manage on six hours if I take a nap uh, earlier in the <laughs> later in the day. Uh, check the marks uh, after the first game. So uh, 91.57. So I think uh, it went up slightly. Tier 9 game, 3 artists, not good, uh, they've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 light tanks, 5 TDs, uh, this will be not fun. So I, once again I'll try to push up to this position, but I'll be really careful because they have so many light tanks. And uh, I need to get some TD support or some other support. Or, or else I won't go up that far. So the LQV and the uh, Bulldog is coming here. And the T49 maybe. AMX is spotting spotting mid. So we got that guy. If I want to be a frontline tank here, so three, four, five, six, seven tanks spotted, ten with RT, and they have had five TDs.
By all means, push up. <laughs> what? You gotta push him now, dude. Come on. So that was some of our guys shooting you. Yeah. Okay, I thought that was already safe here. My bad. See, the problem is that guy isn't really spotting anything, he's just uh, camping behind the corner. And because I'm uh, low HP, that doesn't mean that he should run. Honestly. This is not good. We have uh, too many tanks in the back. The world becomes a collaborative web of interdependent pieces. Yeah. A nice cup of coffee in the morning is the thing. This guy is so uh, chicken. This bullock has been staying uh, at the back all game. Why does it need me to take him by the hand and lead him to the cap? His full HP should be able to do that. It's a top tier light tank for fuck's sake. That was a bad game. A very strange uh, matchmaking. Five light tanks, three artists, that's weird. Okay, yeah, I'll just go and get some coffee as well. So we got the Orelix medal at least, that's something. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah. He was a new player. That's uh, was quite obvious. So let's hope for a better matchmaking in the next uh, match. Okay, this is maybe slightly better. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five mobile tanks, three light tanks, three artists again. Let's see how the team deploys. Scorpion. Scorpion is only the is the really the only really alpha threat. Except from the artist of course. Uh, suiciding. Oh my god, sorry about that. Sorry about that. They seem to be totally uh, unable to uh, go and get that wizard. Yeah. I don't really... I think this map is slightly better than Paris, but it's still not a good map.
Oh, he's AFK actually. May get one shot by the scorpion. I just probably going this direction, I guess. Yeah, he drowned himself as a top tier TD. What's it? Who is it uh, with all these artists this morning? Like three artists in every ma match. That's yeah, I agree. Uh, Paris is probably the bo most boring uh, light tank map ever. You just sit in the bush and try to spot things. So uh, let's see what they got. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven mobile tanks and three light tanks. Four light tanks, actually. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, first tier seven game. I uh, actually think the dispersion of this tank is slightly worse than the AMX, I don't know. You can see the turret, if I move the turret, it's... Uh, it's a very large aim circle. So now we're moving close of artists. Three, four tanks spotted. Mm. Plus three artists, that's six. What? How was I spotted there? Oh, okay. Weaky. He's got uh, reinforcements. I don't know what exactly. Well, they are really pushing the glacier. That was an incredible bad shot. I'm slightly worried about Orty, honestly. Maybe this guy can take a shot? Why should, why should I ask the light tank to take shots? Uh, I'm not really sure yet, uh, Skid. Uh, I think the potential for this tank is maybe uh, better than the AMX, but uh, I'm not sure yet. It, it's got so... Uh, uh, how do you say it? It's 
so now we cleaned up this bank. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure about again yet. Then I'm uh, going back to base. Okay, let's load the. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, once there were two tanks, it was wasn't really that much of a problem as long as I had a full clip. So 5916, okay, squad I will live with him. So I'm reloading again, oops. And I spotted. That was a waste of a shot, honestly. Well, I just want to go close and make sure that I will be able to get two shots into him. And uh, that miss as well, you see. I'm not really sure about uh, this gun. Like the turret dispersion and uh, dispersion while moving is is quite bad, I think, and that makes the otherwise gun good guns that's kind of uh, not so good after all. So uh, Muruanka seems to be uh, a lot of Muruanka encounter in the last days. So let's see what the team got. Seven mobile tanks and three light tanks. We got three light tanks as well, so it's quite close. Three Swedish top tier uh, TDs, two artists this time. KV2, obviously, Alpha Threat. We spotted a scumbag. We took him out. 
Mr. Shiri. So it seems that uh, they're really not pushing forest. So if there got people at cap already, uh, might spot them going here. They got three tanks at cap. Let's see. That missed. Let's see. So really the turret dispersion is horrible. Okay, maybe I should focus on the cap instead. I'm gonna stay down. I don't really understand a team who would go for cap this early in the game while being in the lead as well. So that guy is set with uh, some of the points. That guy has some points. So I missed that. How is it two seven? Seems like the S1 was going down, so maybe he was coming here to come for me. That's a problem. Okay, I want to load heat for this. Oh my god. That was total lack of map awareness. Totally zoomed in. That was really bad.
Roomba has um, got the stock engine, I think. He's so very slow. Just uh, have a quick toilet break, I'll be back in two minutes. Good, maybe I can get uh, clear in my head <laughs> in a while or also. So tier 9 game again. So let's see what they got. They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 mobile tanks and 3 light tanks. 1 RT. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> How is the heavy tank situation? It's about the same. Oh my god. Boosting, boosting warning. I'm not going to stay here alone. Kill this uh, mountain goats. Okay, they came to their senses, luckily. Okay. So yeah, I should have gone. What? What? Okay, I was spotted by those guys, probably. Spotted the Tiger P.
2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Three tanks not spotted. So the force is going uh, that direction. We want to support him. Okay, let's put the SU. Obviously, can't. I'm really looking forward to the AMX thirteen ninety. Well, that guy could have killed me ages ago. Just hoping that the SU won't kill me. Okay, that's better. That means it wasn't really a wasted game after all. Could have so easily been. I'm really wondering where the SU went. There is. See, sometimes this gun isn't really that good. Tiger P is shooting my cover, I think. So, Artifier. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you get uh, those kinds of uh, evenings where everything goes wrong. Happens. I think it will be better by uh, experience though, when you get more games, uh, yeah, 
That's really funny. With more games, uh, you will sort of learn how to not uh, or sort of to mitigate uh, really bad nights. I think the thing is not getting uh, pissed off or getting frustrated if, because if you get like that, then you play bad. So then it's just take a break or do something else. So nine mobile tanks, and they've got like one, two, three, four light tanks. And we got three, four light tanks as well. Uh, no artists, so once again I'll go up to this part of the map. And ignore this part of the map. That's an intelligent question from the wiki. How can I shoot? So let's just hope that uh, not too many heavies are going down. Again, KV2 is probably the uh, biggest alpha threat. I like uh, being one shot by the KV2 once a day is more than enough. So C71 is down there. Oh, setting on fire. Reloading. So ISU is up there. Yeah, <laughs> probably. Oh, KV2. KV2 alert. Yeah, now I want to... Uh, Well, how did it hit me there? Okay. KV2 shot, I think. Yeah. They got the T71 there as well. As long as the ISU is camping in the back, I can't really push the T32. The question is, is the T-150 there still? T-71 is there. Tracked him. Uh, see, once again we are losing uh, this side of the map. Yeah, probably. You can't miss your morning coffee, it's really important. I can't stress how important uh, morning coffee is. Can I get to this bush without getting spotted? I'll just stay here for a bit until I reload and then I'll probably push down. So as you went there, then we should be able to take out the T-150. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 tanks. And that's everything that I got. So all tanks spotted. A hit shot. So 
No, the <coughs> FV is probably. Oh. Yeah, there he is. Oh, that's bad. LTG is there and uh, FV will push up, I think. So <laughs> now I am uh, alone and these guys are going to push on me. So I'll just try to run away or as I like to say uh, relocate bravely that's the thing because these tanks didn't push up enough to give me uh, support what was I spotted by a T-71 probably Okay, can we put a couple of shots into the... No, we can't. Okay. Let's help the Stritzwagen 74 then. Come on. Back up! Oh, thank you. So we got some damage done. I don't know why they go down. <laughs> They're going for cap. This could be fun for the T71. I I think like climbing or boosting, as it's called, is sort of a waste of time, and uh, you lock yourself into a position. Uh, so I just want the flexibility to go where, wherever I want to go on a map. So I think it can work in like uh, clan wars and stuff, but uh, in randoms I don't think it's I don't think it's worth the uh, worth the time and the investment. It kind of looks cool, looks cool, and um, once in a while it's working, but. Uh, it's uh, sort of a, it's sort of a camping strategy. So uh, you're basically uh, waiting for your team to die, so that uh, at least most most of the climbs or boosts I know are kind of like that. Especially when you play a light tank, you really want to be able to go all over the map. So like it's 2.4 combined, I think. So we're at net 91%. Yeah, like I said earlier, I'm really looking forward to uh, trying to tree mark the AMX 1390. Uh, but until then, I I have some other light tanks I need to tree mark first, or try to tree mark. I can't say I will be able to do everything. So if I tree mark the T71 uh, today or tomorrow, that will be tree marked. Three, three mark tanks this week actually, and that's quite good. But uh, T71 and uh, 5916, uh, I started at uh, 88% or something like that, so 
I've done uh, most of the work earlier. So again, tier 9 game. So let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 mobile tanks. 7 mobile tanks and uh, wow, that's the first game with only one light tank each team, so they have a lot of uh, burst power in the AMX and the T-54E1 and the AMX-5100 so if they go together they can probably wreck everything we have nice armor though so we should be able to win the southern part uh, do we have any TDs? yeah we have got the Udes So let's go to this uh, classical spotting bush uh, here and see if we can spot any tanks crossing both north and south. So we spotted uh, three tanks. Oh, a bunch of tanks, really. And the Roomba as well. So how many did we spot? Like one, three, three, four, five, maybe? So I hope that somebody will shoot the Roomba. So the Leo is up north. Let's see if we can spot him again. Yeah, there he is. See, fifty four E one. So then I uh, I need to load heat to be able to pin that guy. So he shot. So there's the M41. Oh, there's T43. Okay, see they are pushing north. So the IS is isolated. So let's see if the. Yeah, I'll check this bit. So he's burning. Really, guys. I should be able to go and take out the IS, I think. 
There's probably some things that's not spotted, so let's hope that he doesn't have any company. Okay, I wasn't spotted, that's good. So I want to get as close as possible. Oh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ooh, is this possible? Is this possible? Can we do this? Can we do this? We made it. <laughs> that was hilarious. So the Stritzwagen is not spotted. And VK. Oh, Tiger one. Let's hope that the Stritzwagen isn't. Isn't here. Something far though. So let's see. Yep, <laughs> that's why you don't like to play heavies. I know, know the feeling. As a heavy, you should never go alone. That's uh, you always have to stay with uh, some uh, other tanks, or that is the thing that will happen to you. Oh, there's the streets again. Same thing with the uh, TD, honestly. So that was uh, tank staying here. Really need the Yog Tiger to push up. I'm not sure we can pen them. I don't think so. Oh, somebody hit him. Try to track him. Oh, I tracked him. I can't let the Yag Tiger stay alone. So, can I be able to get some shots off at those guys? That was close. Yep. The general rule though is that you should never... Okay, the Comet will be able to take him out. You should never go alone, no matter... Okay. As a light tank, that's the only class of tanks that uh, could go alone.
So how how we, how is the time? The thing is with the M4190, he could possibly one shot me with the uh, if he uses HE. So let's find out if he can one shot me. This is a really stupid place to push. But if I can spot them. I'll be happy to. Uh, yeah, it's uh, 4k combined, so that should push us up a little bit. So if the Emil. Uh, we'll take the shot from the Roomba. I could possibly kill him or push in. So, Comet should probably go here. So he's like telling me to stop and just doing nothing. Mm. Yeah, it could be. At least if we win, it should be a highlight, I think. So uh, let's see if we can take out the M41. He's probably going here to flank uh, our guys up north. There he is. I'm, I don't want to stay in a position where the Roomba can shoot me. Wow. So he hit me with... Okay, that's bad. Really bad. Honestly. And the room I can ship me now, but uh, okay, let's see. Yeah. Oh well, let's see if they can be able to win it. <sighs> Should be able to win. When they come at us, yeah, a good position. So now they just need to push into the room, but. And kill him off. So this should be an ace tanker, I think. If this is not, uh, if this is not an ace tanker, then it's really difficult to uh, to get an ace tanker in the T seventy four at the moment. So that's uh, 4,200 combined, so well, let's see, yeah, that was an ace tanker, Autolix medal, 1,561 base XP, that is like 2,342, so yeah, that's uh, that was a good game. So let's uh, save the replay. This might be good uh, for the T71 review that will be coming eventually. So 
So, yeah, let's see. 75% win rate. Uh, see that the thing only brought us up to 92% marks of excellency because uh, we didn't really do that much spotting damage. So it's quite easy to get like a 2k damage game in the T71. So that really didn't push us up uh, too much. So we need more spotting damage to to get the three marks. So we need a good spotting map and uh, mesh make make making with uh, not too many light tanks. So let's see what we got here then. One, two, three, four, five, six. So they've got two light tanks, three artists again. And we got one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven as well, and two light tanks. So in a lineup like this, it's uh, really important to uh, stay alive until the end game, and if possible, to take out the artist as well. So any alpha threats? Not really, except from the artist, so I'm just uh, going across here to spot, uh, see if I can spot their movements. So that Spick, uh, he overloaded a bit too much and he lost like uh, 240 of his uh, HP doing it and he is one of the most valuable tanks in the team. And watch me YOLO as well and do the same. Why are these guys pushing so far in the back? I don't know. The thing is, if I get spotted now, I will get instantly focused by the artist. So still only these two guys spotted on this flank. There's the Jackson as well. These guys need to push up. How can we bounce on Jackson? So get myself in a bit more safer position and waiting for the clip to reload and then I might be able to go in and take out the VK. Oh, he's waiting for me and he got in the first shot. Okay, there are two VKs here. That was bad. So now we want them to get isolated and they've got a Skoda in the back as well. It's like these guys are totally out of the game. Honestly guys. So now we need to do RT evasive maneuvers. Maybe we can spot the Skoda. I think I'm actually playing half bad here. I'm too aggressive. But I somehow I can't uh, 
not not play aggressive now. So he spotted a helicopter as well, so that's bad. Oh, <laughs> that was... That was low. Four tanks uh, destroyed. So let's see, the Hellcat can't one-shot us. Is we don't know where he is. So that's the top gun. And we got two artists and the LC. Now it's just the LC. That's the match, that's true. There he is. That was totally uh, not going to hit him. Oh, cracked him. I got him, so seven kills. <laughs> See, in a match like this, uh, <laughs> Hello, Sian. That should be a nice clip. Uh, so yeah, Top Gun. But the thing is, in a match like this with three artists and stuff, there's really not much uh, HP. So it's difficult to do really a, a lot of damage. Uh, like you saw in the last game, uh, the Ace Tanker in the tier 9 game, there was uh, much uh, more HP to be had, so you can't really do much better than this in a, in a matchup like this. So 92.06. Oh yeah, I've got Nightbot. Sorry about that, Sian. I'll uh, I'll do something about it. Yep, there it is. Okay, it's uh, playing on uh, some kind of uh, browser. Uh, let's see. I opened uh, four versions of that uh, clip, so that was uh, what happened there. So thank you for clipping that, uh, CM. So tier 9 game again. Uh, okay, I haven't paid the attention here. So they've got one, two, three light tanks, two artists. So T49 got up to E1, that's good. Again, too many tanks, like the IS3, goes to a wrong, uh, wrong position. So uh, Sia and I got the clip, so uh, I'll post it in the chat afterwards, uh, so you can see. So 
So uh, TDs spotted. So there are two light tanks on the hill and the T-49 active scouting, scouting mid, so um, that was RT firing at me, I think. That T-43 have been still all game. That was starting again, I think. Let's see if the T-43 is still there. Oh. No, he has moved. Thing is, it's really hard to push into those guys without uh, getting totally trashed. So hopefully we can spot them and Art they can take them out. This is uh, stupid, but let's see if we can spot them. Oh, spotted two of them. So now it's only the Scorpion. And maybe the SU, yeah, yeah, it's only the Scorpion, there he is. Okay, we capped? I didn't pay attention to that. That was really stupid. My bad. You don't expect them to cap in a, <laughs> in a situation like that. See, that's not good for anybody on the team. We have worse uh, HP than if we, uh, if we lost the game, basically. So yeah, let's uh, see if we can get that clip. So uh, that was the clip, uh, I think. That was quite fun. So yeah, once again, uh, Sian, thank you for uh, for that clip. So yeah, let's uh, continue. So tier 9 game. Uh, what do they got? They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 3 light tanks. We got 1, 2, 3, light tanks as well. Jag Tiger, Roomba, okay. Again I'll just try to go to this bush and spot the tanks pushing up. Like probably most of our light tanks.
They should have some tier 7s, that should be uh, nice targets for us. So let's see if we spot anything. Really? Nothing here? Honestly, nothing? That Roomba is behind a building, so... Okay, that means they are pushing the other flank, basically. Or camping. Really camping. So... Let's see if we can spot anything else. They have uh, five TDs, so there should be a lot of stuff camping here. They have the SU, the J Tiger. I was hoping for a tracking shutter, but uh, that didn't happen. So now they have lost uh, a lot of map control, which is uh, important in uh, these kind of maps. Let's see if we can push up a little bit to get some uh, better spotting positions. Right. So the T-54 Mark 1 is uh, AFK, it seems. Yeah, uh, just, but you can see the link in the chat skip. So I'm quite alone here. Let's see if we can isolate some tanks. Yeah, they're pushing in. And once again we got this capping situation. Don't cap! Okay, that's good. Oh, Jack Tiger. <laughs> he missed me. Come on, Jack Tiger. You can do it. Come on, Jack Tiger. You can do it. He missed me again. It's hilarious. Let's see. 
Okay, now the clip is gone, so I don't know what happened. It's not there anymore. So maybe it got deleted or, or something, so... Uh, I'll make a clip out of that after the stream, anyways. Make it a highlight as well, so... Uh, I don't know where so I should be able to find it. Yeah, I see, and uh, the thing, uh, I don't know. The clip isn't there anymore. I don't know why. Maybe it disappears like uh, after some minutes. I don't know. So that was uh, 3 point, uh, what was it, 17 plus my math skills, 3.3 combined, so that should bring us up again. <laughs> yeah, report to Twitch please. So while these guys are uh, killing off the two the last tanks, I'll get some coffee. Be right back. Ninety one point eighty six, so it went up again, I think. After that horrible capping game. So, Fjords tier eight game, one RT, and let's see how many. One, two, three, no, okay, one, two, three, four, five. Five mobile tanks, plus the Emil, that's six, really. So, 1, 2, 3, three 4, 5, 6, and 3 light tanks on each team. So, let's see what we can do. Let's go. So, on this map, Skid, uh, regarding boosting and climbing, here's one of the few like useful boosts up to this position here where you can shoot at the guys camping by the bush still kind of risky when you get like three light tanks so uh, it's very seldom that i use it so probably the type 64 is uh, going up there to the like boosting position So we got the Cromwell, let's move back a bit and... So we put two shots into him. See, uh, the Type 64 is now in this position I talked about. Up here. So that can be useful. So two tanks spotted. Big will probably be dead. Okay, I'll 
go here and help the 5916 then. Yeah. To this spotting bush. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 tanks spotted, 7 with the RT, so that's 8 tanks not spotted. There's the 9 tanks spotted. That won't pen him, I think. So Arty hit the uh, Arl. No, I have lost count again. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We seem to be pushing south, we have those guys in a crossfire, so I just want to hold this position until... Because we are only basically two tanks here. Plus Arty, that's doing a good job. So he's going back, I think. So A43, Arl was... I need two shots for him, and SU... He's dead. So basically now I'm just holding this position. That's basically me and RT holding and Type 64 holding for four tanks. So they should have cleaned out the south soon. I see now the T37 is here, so that means there's only three tanks here. There's the Yelp Hunter, the Arl and the A43. And that guy. It's uh, making sure that RT is safe. Okay, let's try to YOLO in and see if we can do stuff. Okay, he YOLO'd out at the uh, worst time. So he probably counted my shots. Okay, so the type destroyed him. The Arl. So now it's uh, the RT, the Emil, and the Judas. And this guy is finally pushing out from his uh, RT position. That's a very marginal shot as well. Those are much better shots. Okay. Reloading again. I don't think I will be able to do more damage to the... Okay, if he wants to... <laughs> a killer type, that's hilarious. So that was a good game as well. So 
So that's uh, 3.3 combined again. He had a really good game. I'm going to compliment him on that. So let's see how we're doing on the marks. 92.4. So getting closer. So El Haluf, a uh, tier 9 game. They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 mobile tanks and 4 light tanks. And we got 1, 2, 3, 4. Five, six, seven, eight, nine mobile tanks and four light tanks as well. Hello, Escape. Uh, I'm not really sure what you mean. Uh, can you say it in, in uh, English, please? My German is not that good. Not good timing, honestly. They have a lot of things coming. They will probably lose this uh, flank quite quick. With so many tanks camp camping the base. Oh. That's well, again. Bad by me. Oh, yeah. Uh, my bad. So, yeah, that's kind of the problem with the four light tanks in uh, the matchmaking. Uh, you tend to get more YOLOing and then stuff like this can happen. So yeah, I'm not waiting for... I'm not watching this game finish. I'll just uh, go back to Garage and uh, play... Play another game in another tank while we wait. So let's uh, do one in the... Spick. So tier 7 game, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 mobile tanks. And uh, how many light tanks again? 1, 2 light tanks. And we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 2 light tanks as well. So uh, I'll go... Uh, 
to this uh, position here by the houses and uh, hope to spot the tanks crossing into city and TDs camping this ridge. So uh, hopefully I'll get some support from this uh, little ridge here on our side. So I have uh, tanks shooting at the things I'll spot. Okay, that's bad. I'm not loading heat for the beginning of the game. There's a guy that recognizes that this is a good matchmaking for me. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to tune this afternoon. Uh, so already 1000 spotting damage. You see this is quite a good position to spot, uh, spot things. Cromwell is here as well, so then that means I'm just going one bit further. So I don't have uh, shots at him, he's held down. So we spotted the T-150. So now we've done 1500 spotting damage. Okay, maybe we can uh, shoot the T-29 if it crosses in here. So we got... Uh, more heavy tanks pushing into city. Okay, let's do some counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 with the guy who's dead. 13, 14 with Artie. That means one tank's not spotted. Basically. So of course that bounces. Okay, so that flank is totally lost. Then we want to push the push the guys here. Clean up this flank and uh, that was the KV2 miss me with their shot. And that was the Arty shooting that guy. So let's see. The KV2 there as well. That was the last guy. T T3485. So uh, tank, last tank, not spotted. Okay, So this is really not uh, fast enough for my liking. So let's see all the way in for the Type 64. Uh, and I hope that. Wow, he focused me. Come on. Oh, not, not good RNG, not good RNG, not good RNG. Finally, some uh, lucky bounces. Uh, okay. They haven't managed to kill off that. Uh... And then uh, I bounce again. Okay, GG. <coughs> so that was uh, 2.5 combined, I think. It'll probably be a loss though. Because these guys in the city, the KV3, was really, really too slow uh, pushing in and killing the T29. So that means probably uh, this is a loss. 
And I have to go to the toilet again. Sorry about that. Too much coffee in here. I'll be right back. So yeah, I'm back and this seems to be a loss here for sure. Okay, since there's only Artie left, let's uh, see the kill Artie and uh, look at the result from this match as well. Before we go and take a look at uh, results from the El Haluf battle, and that was uh, again a, a win. Not my not my fault that we won that game, but but still, it's nice to get some bonus wins. So yeah, let's see. Only one shot, no, two shots of damage, 2200. So still at 79% win rate. So let's see here. El Haluf game, yeah, that was really bad. That was 7... 800 combined, that's really, really bad. So, yeah, let's continue with the T71. So, end scan counter. Uh, tier 9 game That guy we met earlier I I think I know that name from somewhere But no no He might be a guy I've played with earlier. I don't know. So let's w see one two three four five mobile tanks two light tanks and we got one two three for five as well. Okay, this time I'll try to. Okay, I have a, I have a bad, bad spawn for that, so I'll just stick to my regular spot. The guys crossing into city thingy. spotted as well. Did 
dude. Come on. Two, three, four, five, six tanks spotted. Seven with RT. Not reacting. Okay, let's reload them. <coughs> So both the Onis seem to be isolated. So let's see if we can uh, do something about that. Oh, Scorpion. Okay, he's not isolated. Let's hope that our uh, Oni is uh, isolated now. Okay, he's there. Oh, driving skits. Log is coming. I don't know if he fired or not, so obviously, obviously he didn't. We got him. Know what to relocate so the scorpion doesn't shoot me. Want to help out these guys with a uh, bulldog and uh, Oni over there. Problem is the scorpion might be there as well. Uh, he's the over there, so it should be a good shot. And he won't know. Ooh. So we got him as well. There's still one RT left, so we need to be careful about that. So those guys are pushing in. Something spotted me here. It's probably the RT. Tracked him. So then again, reloading. They have four tanks left. So let's see, he's quite good HP. So the Judas is running as well. So now we want uh, VK to be the first guy to push in. Okay, the Roomba is there. This is stupid though. LQB is probably camping in that same position, so I still want to... Uh CAFK?
So the LKB is there, and the Roomba is there. So he was in fact AFK. So let's uh, reload and uh, see if we can find the uh, scorpion. Scorpion can one shot me though. Seems to be totally clueless that you this. is in fact one shot so we got him that's good room is one shot as well I don't know, is he still camping here? Let's go find out. GG. That was another race tanker. Okay. So that was three. Three nine combined. So let's save that replay as well. So 92.55 Getting closer again So yeah, let's see again here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 6, 7 mobile tanks and uh, Three light tanks, and we've got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and three light tanks as well. So then again, going to this little ridge to try to spot things. <coughs> spot tanks moving in this direction and moving across up to hill. Oh. For the T25 pilot. So that guy got us got off a shot into us. Yeah it's a it's a really nice uh, nice uh, stat thingy. Uh, he, uh, <coughs> that guy, the Swedish tank driver, what his name is, he uh, makes a good mod pack as well. That was the last mod pack I used. Did 
didn't I hit him with that one sir? So this is kind of the wrong positions, like this guy, T-54. T-54 is uh, one of the best frontline tanks ever. So he's moving up now, that's good. So I was spotted. This isn't really looking too good. So I should be able to push the KB4 now. So they are pushing hill quite heavily. Uh, so we want to help the Mausian and uh, VZ with uh, pushing the Comet and the KV4 and then go kill RT. So no hardy here, it's probably up here then. Yeah. So the M12 should be around here somewhere as well. We don't know yet uh, if they are still up on How did you know that? Was I still spotted? That was rather strange. So that was a bad game again. Uh, only did uh, 1000 combined. Yeah, it was probably a blind shot. There's no uh, need to be that suspicious. Uh, or maybe actually the IS-2 spotted me, I don't know. Before and I didn't spot him. Could have happened. So this might be a loss again. Uh, I think they will be able to reset a little. Yep, they will be able to reset. Unless the Leo takes out the... No, he missed. So 
So now the T71 needs to watch basically the Mausian's back. He's got two stars, so he, uh, two marks of excellency, so he's probably a decent player. So. Uh, he doesn't. You don't want uh, Emil to clip the mouse in. Thank you, uh, Dino, for the follow. I really appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Hey, chilled. I think I'm at like ninety two point something. At the T71 more so excellency. Uh, gotten two ace tankers so far this uh, today with it. T71 can't stay here. <laughs> he need to do something. No, he's almost dead. <laughs> so he has got one shot left, and that's uh, that's the game, basically. GG. Look to the sky, out to the stars, Emil too might be a really good player. I don't know. Let's uh, check his stats after the game. He has played uh, quite well, I think. Let's see, he is running in that direction. There's five minutes left. Yeah, basically he needs to position himself in a po like where he can spot them and they can spot him and like uh, shoot uh, and spot it if he can, or if not, have some hard cover. They'll probably go and try to cap. I'm guessing the IS2 will go cap and the uh, Emil will chase him down for the top gun. So, on top of this little ridge, there's a bush at least. Both are going for cap. And he was spotted, so yeah. They know where he is now, so I don't think he will be able to do too much. I don't know the ammo capacity on the ML2, uh, but he has uh, shot a lot, so maybe he's uh, close to empty. Reset, that's good. Yeah, hello, Lexicon. Yeah, maybe. I think it should be possible. Uh, it may take may take today and tomorrow, but I should be able to do it. I think. So uh, 
then it will be interesting to like compare the T71 with the AMX 1375, which I uh, three marked like three days ago or something. I'm not sure. Uh, I think like the dispersion uh, while moving is kind of bad. Uh, well, thank you very much. Uh, so let's check the unknown. Is a reroll, I think, or maybe not. But he played well, so good for him. Let's see that guy. He is a reroll. Yeah, I have uh, on my YouTube channel. I have uh, a review of the 1375 and uh, some videos of me tree marking it. Uh, okay, let's get the personal reserves going again. So, tier 9 game again, city map again. Two artists, and let's do the team breakdowns. They've got one, two, three, four, five mobile tanks. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, all about uh, what you like to play, I think. I really like the light tanks, so. Uh, I sort of want to tree mark most of them. And we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, how many light tanks? Three light tanks. T30 is an Alpha Threat Scorpion. SU. Yeah, uh, old T-71 was probably much better. Oh. So I'm spotted... ...by something. By what? I don't know. by those guys. <laughs> How bad I didn't rush any further. So the T-54 light is going for the artist. Okay, they got the KB-5 here as well. Wow, there are really a lot of tanks here. Too much YOLO for me. They have a lot of tanks on this side, and probably should... Uh, is the KV-5 pushing as well? Track him. So really doing... and the pushing. Wow, this is not good. So you need to relocate bravely again. Take that Pershing. You can't really win this uh, flank. You need to sort of. Uh, get out of dodge and try to get to the other flank. Man, 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 the RNG! Yeah, I like the 5916. I think it's uh, that's surprisingly good, actually.
So uh, let's get some breathing space and uh, think what to do next. Question is if the Pershing is pushed up or is still here in base. This is a really a bad position, but the um, game is ending soon, I think. So Pershing was uh, focusing in this corner. Man, he <laughs> hit me like three times this game. Uh, I have marked uh, Chaffee the T37 AMX 12T. Yeah, and AMX 1375. And uh, the 59 yeah. So I didn't really start with a tree marking of tanks until like, I don't know, maybe a month, month ago or something. So uh, I want to do. Uh, I'll just go the different light tanks tree, uh, trees and uh, see if I can uh, mark uh, most of them. Uh, if I can, uh, yeah, at least as long as I find them playable. There might be some light tanks that I don't like, so I don't know. Let's see. I'm really looking forward to like marking a, trying to tree mark the AMX 1390. Seems to be really good after uh, after the new matchmaking system. But this. Um, Match and the last one was uh, quite bad, so I probably dropped down to 91 point something now on the three marks. Yeah, bad, bad game. Uh, let's see. Yeah, 91.57. Yeah, uh, I'd probably try to do some mediums after I would, like, I'm fed up with the light tanks. Uh, I'm not really sure. At the moment, I don't think I'll be able to 3 mark the T62. I, I'm not really... I don't play that tank very, very well at the moment, even though I have a lot of battles in it. I used to play it a lot, like, for two, two years ago or something. So, uh, finally t tier 7 game, so let's see what they got. They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 mobile tanks and 1, 2, 3 light tanks. We are probably the same, I guess. The matchmaking it seems to be quite even nowadays. So... I'll just... Uh, um, push up to the castle again, see if you can spot uh, spot any tanks. So this should be really good matchmaking for me. So let's see if we can change the recent thread uh, train. Yeah, it, like, yeah, probably 62A uh, is uh, kind of difficult, I think. It seems to be uh, many really good players playing the 62 and the 140, so those are more difficult tanks to tree mark, I guess. Oh, that's you. That guy we should take out. Try 
distract him at least. Okay, let's see if we got any shots on these guys. Churchill pushing up as well. So he just fired. We got him. Continue, continue. Oh, bounced. <laughs> yes, kid, that's at least something. You'll probably get uh, plenty more marks when you get some more experience. Let's try to track him. That shot missed. So we got him as well. Uh, Arty fired. So this game is 10 1. Wow, that's quick. That's too quick, really. So bounced on the RT, that's uh, something. Oh, another RT. That missed. So, yeah. Yeah. I like those tanks as well, uh, the Rudy and the T3485. I don't think I've played the Type 58 yet. So that was, uh, I don't know. No, it was not nice. That was like 1800 plus, let's say, 2k, that's 3.8 3 combined. I don't think, uh, it was because I was top tier, and uh, then that made, made it not an ace, thank you. So 92.28. Okay. Yeah, I find uh, those are like the earliest medium tanks on that line. That's really good with the uh, nice combination of uh, camo and <coughs> alpha and uh, DPM and uh, nice uh, gun, gun handling as well. Yeah, that reminds me, Skid, I have totally forgotten to watch that game. Uh, I'll promise you I'll watch it after the stream is done. Maybe I'll do a replay commentary on it. Oh yeah, so they're going for uh, 100 percent on Rudy. T25 pilot. I've totally forgotten to do the team breakdowns here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 mobile tanks. The scorpion is there, so he might be camping me. Okay, so let's reload them. Yeah, I find uh, if I really like a tank, then I might try to get to 100 later, but 
At the moment I find it's uh, hard enough to get to 95, so it will be like if some favorite tank or something I might do 100%, I don't know. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, the KV-13, I think it's uh, underrated. Uh, it can really boss around in the tier 7 matches because of the armor and stuff. Maybe I'll start with the uh, KV-85. No, the KV-13 then. When I'm going to my mediums. This game is really going nowhere. But that should be quite easy, I think, with the KV-13, 2K. Oh, MT-25. Problem is the pilot camping in the back as well. really need some help here, I think. If I should be able to shoot at that guy. It's very polite of the MT-25 to wait for me uh, to reload. Well, oh, that's... yeah. Bad. That was really... Uh, bad play by me. That doesn't do the three marks any good. Yeah, that's true. You have to be like, is it tier 5? That's the limit for uh, 3 marking tanks. It can't be any lower. So uh, I think you should be able to uh, 3 mark the Shafi skin uh, when you get to that after the Stuart. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys, I'll just need to change my batteries on my uh, whip. I'll just... It takes like 30 seconds. I'll just uh, get them, so I'll be here soon.
So yeah, that wasn't a good game. So what happened to my music? That was uh, silent. Should probably be back on in a minute. So yeah, let's go on to the next next game, and I hope that the music will return. Uh, I think it should be like two point five uh, combined for it not to go down. Around that, I think. It was that on the AMX 1375. Uh, I think that was about 2.5. So three light tanks, four light tanks, mm. one RT, and a uh, KB2 as well. Yeah. Uh, T-71 seems to be quite a popular light tank as well, so many players playing it. Okay, that makes sense really. Yep. So the light tanks going for cap, that usually means they're not the best of players, I think. I played the VZ uh, a bit. <laughs> Look at all these things. Finally, I have a tank. Track him, I think. So, that's kind of weird. Weird positioning. Okay, there seem to be pushing in. Need to be more involved here if I'm going to get any damage. I just behind a rock. Okay, I didn't know that. Like, that was good to know. Oh, 
expected. Miss that guy. So AMX. AMX is going for the Oni. I have a larger clip and a faster intra clip reloaded than that guy, so I should be able to take him out. So he used one. So he was reload, reloading. So batch set coming again. So or maybe running again. I don't know. Target acquired. That missed. Wow, that missed again. <laughs> that missed again. <laughs> what the hell? He's got some magical shield. Wow. Have you seen? I never missed that many shots in a clip on an OTM. So yeah, that was uh, 1600 combined, so that wasn't good enough. Okay, so this is offline, then I need to find, uh, find some other music, let's see. So I'll just uh, skip this ad and then we're back again. So yeah, let's uh, check the marks uh, real quick. 91.53, so it's dropped again. Wow. Hello, Lordy. Welcome to my... Uh, Slightly less than 92% uh, uh, marks of excellency stream. Thank you for the follow, uh, Lexington. Really appreciate it. What's up? Is uh, me not um, seeming to manage to get some music on my stream? Let's see. Yeah, okay. So let's go for the next. Yeah, this seems to be happening quite often. Uh, corridor maps. We all know that uh, World Gaming loves uh, its corridor maps. So I should probably get like Malinovka with a good spawn or something to really get close. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mobile tanks, three, three light tanks, KV2, that's not good, one RT, A 
AMX 1375 is going to spot the bridge. That's not really cool. Bad shots by me, honestly. Come on guys, take him out. Take him out. He might be on a reload actually. Thank you, uh, thank you, Lexington. Take care, and I hope to see you again soon. Why oh, rushing in? <laughs> That's cool. So let's see. We might be able to shoot at the tanks. Oh, like that guy. Heat, I think, for that guy. the reload on the studio emil let's find out so he fired again But again, You know, it seems to be working. Yeah, that was okay. No, it stopped again. <laughs> Honestly.
Okay, uh, hopefully it should work now. Welcome back to Monster Cat Call of the Wild. We hope you guys had an amazing week. We've got a good one, so let's just get this hour going. Today we'll be hearing new stuff from Faint, Subtax, Slander, and World, and we also have heaps of Rocket League exclusives to share with you guys, like this tune coming in now, which will be on the Rocket League soundtrack July 5th. This is brand new Faint featuring Milk with Outbreak. So yeah, let's see if the KV1 is uh, KV2 can take out the OI. Cromwell might as well go. I don't know. Should he go cap? I don't know. I think uh, you need like 2.5 combined uh, Lordy, around that. Uh, yeah, around that I find. Like. Uh, I think Skid said earlier that I uh, it went up 0.2% uh, when I got like 3k combined. Yeah, probably a little bit more. <laughs> so I need some good uh, scouting maps and uh, not this uh, corridor thingy. So the OI might be able to uh, one shot the KV2. Uh, the KV2 has got the uh, 107 mm again, I think. So that means he's got like 217 pen or something. Yeah, it's a fun tank, but uh, still, I find it to be he missed. So they should be able to reset now. Okay, KV2 didn't pen him. Yeah, I know the feeling, yeah, that's good. It's not that often uh, you get like uh, pool medals, so you really want them to be wins as well. Yeah, it's uh, the T-71 is a fun tank, but I think uh, they seem to have changed like the turret dispersion and uh, general dispersion values. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was uh, thinking of um, tree marking the Type 64 as well. Uh, I might do that after, or trying to tree mark it. I might do, do that after uh, tree marking the T71 if uh, <laughs> if I manage to tree mark T71. I think it's a very popular tier 6 uh, light tank at the moment, the Type 64. Uh, it's got really good uh, DPM. Yeah, Lemming Rush uh, did a video about it not long time ago and he seemed to be able to 3 mark it. So. It's probably among the best tier 6 uh, light tank, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lori. Uh, that seems to be kind of difficult then. How much combined do you need for the tree marks on the ty Type 64, you think? Is it like uh, 2k combined or something? Yeah, really. Okay, so maybe it's uh, 2.5 or close to 2.5. That's uh, quite a lot for a tier 6.
Uh, yeah, sure. I don't know. Uh, I haven't tried this. Uh, Wow, that works actually. I'm proud of myself. That's a really good game. No link. Okay, I'll just uh, I'll just uh, post it in the chat mm -hmm. so you guys can see it there. Yeah, Nightbot is a. Uh, I haven't <laughs> learned to. Use it properly. Okay. <laughs> I see the problem then, if it, that was only 1.2. Wow, <laughs> well, I didn't even see that, but that uh, became a defeat. Well. Wow. Yeah, that's the problem. You need spotting. You need spotting. And it depends. It's so map dependent and so team li lineup dependent. I find some of these uh, matches uh, nowadays is like four or five light tanks, and then it's really difficult to get spotting if you're not on a really good spotting map. So it's kind of more difficult I find after the update. So uh, let's see, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven mobile tanks and one, two light tanks. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, and two light tanks. So it's quite even. One arty each. Yeah. So now I'll just uh, try to go over to this position here and try to spot them. Pushing up here. Yeah, that's the thing, like in tier 7 games as well, there's uh, usually not enough HP to get really good uh, damage and uh, spotting damage as well, so. <laughs> so you're older uh, than me, Lordy? I can't believe that, really. Oh, nice, Lori. Good to have some uh, people that's older than me. I find that really there's quite a few quite uh, quite old streamers about. Tracking the thumbs. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's push up and see if we can... Uh... Yeah, <laughs> probably. <laughs> I think that's uh, it's good that it's not only young guys playing this game. I think this is one of the, one of the games where you are not... Uh, really don't need to be... 
that dependent on the reflexes. Oh, that's cool. Oh, so it was the ML2 that spotted me. That guy. Guys needs to push up. That was a really bad shot. Might have to look out for Artie. Sort of hold down there. That guy is more. So these guys are too passive now. We honestly need to take out that guy. Artie should have taken out that guy a long time ago. Okay, reloading. T54 need to do something. Okay, if the T-54 light is alone, I might be able to take him out. That depends though. That's an ice tree. He's probably trying to ram me. Fuck me. That's just enough to keep it at the same uh, kind of marks of excellency, I think. <coughs> T54 is uh, almost full HP. And he should be... Uh, yeah, he, he can't have the top gun, honestly. Bouncing off the back of the tiger. Here's another rocket league track for you. This is well to lift drift. He won't uh, be able to reset. So if they had kept uh, earlier, that might be uh, that might be a win. Yeah. 
Yeah, he actually had a good game though. Or damage wise at least. So that was 2.5 combined. <laughs> this won't be good. Uh, 91.55. <laughs> Before I get to the bat chat, uh, it probably will be the new new version of the bat chat, and I don't think that will be very good from what I have seen of the stats and stuff. Um, I don't know. It's probably stay the same, around the same at least. So yeah, let's do the team breakdowns before I forget again. Uh, one, two, three, four, five mobile tanks, two light tanks. Yeah, the batch that is not an OP tank. It's really, uh, it's difficult to play. It's really fun, but difficult to play. Yeah. I agree with that, uh, Lordy. Yeah. How many YOLO back chatting uh, guys do you see? Like, uh, that happens all the time. Or it used to happen all the time, at least. So what these guys are doing, I don't know. Are you serious? <laughs> That's true. YOLO camping for the win. So, want the uh, Scorpion to be taken out? Then again, I should be probably able to... Flank the A44 or something. But I want the uh, scorpion to be dead. This tune coming in now will also be on the Rocket League soundtrack. Our leader this week is Subtat's newest. He is Call Me. Come on, AMX, be spotted by the scorpion. There he is. Fuck. Okay, he was taken out, that's good. So now they are at our base. So we want to YOLO in and uh, finish, uh, try to finish them off. So the eye is fired, and that's good. So he's turning towards me. Push in then, guys. Push in. Yeah, then we can go back. Uh, okay. <coughs> Didn't really do much here, you know, either. So where is the IS-3 and uh, stuff? Uh, so 
they have a SU, IS-3 and FV probably on that uh, over here. Don't cap for a oh, okay. Think we can pin him? I don't think so. Just try to keep him tracked then. No. Oh. Easier targets. That's not good. Thanks for saying hi. We love hearing from you guys. If you'd like a shout out next week, use hashtag COTW159 and tell us your name. Yeah, I don't think I can pin that guy either. And now let's check out who's called in this week. So let's see if we can get some shots on the tiger. Or the are you? Fridays. So this is 3.5 combined and uh, <coughs> should be interesting to see how much it goes up now. Because this is 3.5 combined in a tier 9 game as well. Uh, means more XP I think. Yeah, 3.6, that's true. My math skills. So that we got two more, so that's uh, 3.8. 3.8 combined. <clears throat> so let's see. That's up to 92.28, so that was like, I don't know, 0 0.6 or 7 percentage uh, points up. So 92.28, remember that. And I hope that uh, I get a good scouting map here again. Yeah, I think so as well, so my math ma uh, skills again. So yeah, let's see tier 9 game, there you go, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 mobile tanks, 3 light tanks, 2 RTs, 5 TDs, thank you Lori for doing my math, <laughs> always good, and we got one, wow, really, one, Two, if you can't show you two, two, three, four, three light tanks as well. It depends. It varies from game to game, to be honest. I think I'm still kind of used to the old APCR pen on this, so I. I'm not really... Uh, oh. That's interesting uh, team positioning. So hopefully they get some shots into those guys. So that was 600 spotting damage. They don't seem to have anything in mid. Which is kind of strange. 
to spot the Batchet Arty. That's good. Hopefully they take him out. So they have a lot of tanks back there. What? That guy. <clears throat> so let's see if we can spot that uh, SDA then. Wow. That was bad. <laughs> they hit me again. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Who is that guy? Youngest 12 14. These guys, honestly. So now I'll be. Let's see, can I get shots off into those guys? <laughs> he hit me again. Where is he? <laughs> Man! How is he outspotting me? How is he outspotting me? Is he camping with Binox or stuff? I don't know. So the Roomba there, if he had... Uh, there is the SDA too. Yeah, probably. It could have been the Roomba spotting me if he had the Binox, I guess. But that guy was shooting me all game. Totally different positions as well. So, yep. Yeah, uh, it'd be interesting to see... His stats after the game. Luckily he's dead now, so... He probably his only damage this game was me. Maybe. So that's bad, so that was 1.1k combined, or only spotting really, so... That should uh, bring us down a bit again, I think. This guy has saved a lot of fuel consumption in this game. So, uh, how is your tooth going, Skid? Is it uh, good now? 
No more painkillers. Finally. <coughs> So let's see uh, <clears throat> how much we uh, lost. So he did uh, quite well. So yeah. Well, that's good. Painkillers suck. So back down to 91.86, so uh, I don't know, point, uh, 0.3 or 4, something went down. So we should get like Malinovka and like a 4k spotting game, doing 2k damage, but <laughs> yeah, this is what we get. It's a good matchmaking though, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six mobile tanks. So I should probably go to this position here in the beginning, trying to spot the tanks going to the this super bowl down in the corner. So if we survive a little bit longer in this game, we should be able to do damage at least. So... No real alpha threats, maybe the KV-85 has got... Uh, I don't know if the KV-85 can get the 122 gun or not. Can't remember. Bounce the air control. So it with one shot into him at least. Well, I'm spotted. Reloading them. So we got the OI going in that direction as well. So one, two, three, four. Four tanks spotted. That's not enough. Do you have a shot on them here? So really want to have is to push in so we can uh, know where the team is. Oh, here's the team. Bad shot. Aiming for his engine, so he'll burn. He might have moved. So we're pushing the T-3485 after this... Uh, That was bad. <laughs> he had the 132 gun, that's for sure. That was bad play by me. So can we spot these guys then? Again. What? With play like that, you won't get to the three marks today, that's for sure. That was really bad by me. That 
back I was still there. Well... <sighs> Just get rid of my sweater. It's starting to get uh, warm here now. So. One moment. So I think my concentration is, is starting to slip a bit, so let's see, we've been streaming for three and a half hours. The thing is, uh, after this game I might be back to where I started basically, <laughs> before I started streaming on the Marks of Excellency. So that's not good. So now we at least know that KV-85 has got the 122 gun. Potentially. So our E25 has got the uh, top gun. But he is low HP, so shouldn't be he tracked that guy. So that's good, then it's 12 full. Steered email. KV85 need to push up. Maybe it's AFK, I don't know. It looks AFK. smaller or something? Maybe I changed it. So let's see. Was it smaller or larger or something? I don't know. I can't tell the difference. Yep, yeah, wasn't it like that all the time? I don't know. Okay, what will happen if I move this down then? Then it disappears. Uh, I need to find a way to make this tra transparent, I think. It was? Hmm. Let's uh, check the settings then, if I... Find 
That's weird. Hmm. Let's check the settings then. Hey, your votes. Our throwback of the week is Rootkit featuring Danica Nado with Real Love. To place your vote for a future throwback, head to live.monstercat.com during our stream. I'm not sure, to be honest. So it's the E25 versus the KV1, uh, then the E25 should win, I think. Maybe get a... You can't see skip? Oh, that's weird. Uh, skip is on YouTube. I'm streaming to both YouTube and Twitch at the same time. So skip is... Uh, I'm joining uh, both chats with this... Uh, with this app. Uh, Restream chat, so... He is watching on YouTube and you're watching on Twitch, that's probably why. And Lordy, if you're not following me on YouTube, please do. <laughs> I seem to get Twitch followers uh, much faster than uh, YouTube followers. And when I get to like 50 followers both on YouTube and uh, Twitch, I'll do a giveaway on stream. Uh, for 6 months of premium. No problem Lordy, I'll follow you gladly. If I'm not doing it already, I don't know. I should really make it uh, transparent, but uh, I, I don't know how to do that yet, so I'll do that uh, later. Try to get it uh, before tomorrow's... Uh, Tomorrow's stream at the same time. So let's check the marks again. I fear that this is going down further. So, yeah. No, it's at 91.28 and I, 26, and that's like even worse than when I started today. So that's not good. So 68% win rate and 4,800. We need. That's uh, quite. Uh, that's worse than yesterday. Only at 1400 average damage, approximately, and yesterday it was at 1500 something. So let's hope for a good uh, scouting map now, so we can get it uh, higher than it was when I started, at least. Not really. This is. Uh, Honestly, a corridor map as well. So do. And a tier 9 game, so let's see. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 mobile tanks. 3 light tanks. Maybe it's my imagination, but I find that the T71 gets tier 9 matches more often than the AMX 1375. That might be only like confirmation bias, but I don't know. Maybe I've been unlucky with the matchmaking these um, the last few days. So I'll just go uh, up on this uh, little uh, hill here to see if I can spot anything. 
usually we should be able to spot some tanks. Heavy tanks crossing the base area. Yeah, that's true, uh, Skid. No, I don't think I can pin him. So, T54 lightweight. We got two artists as well, must remember that. So, three, four, five, six, seven tanks spotted. So the Emil is pushing into base. Mm. Should be able to put some shots into the VK, I think. Now we might be hit by Arty. So then I'm reloading. So it's one four. He's not there. The problem is the guys on hill might be able to shoot me. So yeah, reloading again. AMX CDC. So he missed me luckily. These guys are totally out of place. And uh, lately I've been rammed to death too much by these guys. So 33 seconds for cap. That guy should spot them. Hello friend. So they got people pushing up there as well. Let's see. That bounced. Wow. That's uh, really a lot of things. So that missed again. That guy might be able to shoot me. Okay, so we're loading heat for the Emil. So he's coming after me then. Problem is the object. Okay, so the object is ignoring that guy. Fuck. I bounced again and I hit him but now I'm reloading I don't know he's here maybe reloading again as well no he's not reloading so the object might be able to shoot me as well so we reset <laughs> Honestly. T-54 
see it, it misses quite a lot. So we reset these guys. So that was 3.3, I guess, close to it at least. So the, he should be able to cap it out. Problem is uh, they're coming in bridge possibly. I don't think the LQE and the A44. No, don't show yourself. Don't show yourself, man. Oh, okay, my bad. They're capping. Ah, uh, that's bad. I thought uh, I reset them enough, but I obviously didn't. So that was my bad. So that was <laughs> Master Badge first class on a loss. Uh, Orlix medal, Defender. I did 1k more damage than the second guy on the, the team. In a bottom tier light tank. So, did that bring us up a little bit maybe? Yeah, so now it's 5k win 8, it should be at 5k win 8, really, when playing light tanks. Well, thank you, Skid, but it still wasn't a win, so let's see, did that bring us up anything? So now it's back up at 91.8, so that's up uh, yeah, 0.6% points, I guess, so still tier 9 game. Corridor map, as usual. So, uh, let's see again. Do the team breakdowns. They got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 mobile tanks, 3 light tanks, and no artists. And we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 mobile tanks as well. <coughs> and three light tanks. So with these guys, no, I'm loading heat, Lordy. So you can see. Yeah, it was a thing here by spotting for the TDs, the seven eight line. I should maybe try that. <coughs> there should be a like spot here where I can get up. I guess. So, where is it that I'm staying here? Is it here? No, oh, that's bad. So these guys are crossing over to the other part. So do we spot anything here? No, they have a shitload of tanks in the mid. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten tanks spotted. Yeah, should we pay attention to those guys? No, probably they are just camping me there. So 
these guys should do something. Sort of trapped in this position. I guess I could go back along this ridge and try to. Uh, but again, these two guys will have shots on me. And the guys camping me in mid will have shots at me as well. So he's on the other side now. So is the T49 there? I don't see him. So if I go up a bit, maybe I am safe from those guys in the mid. Maybe I can put some shots into the light tanks. No, oh, they spotted me obviously. I haven't done anything here. You're being stopped by two light tanks, man. Oh. He's got good DPM, so I might be toast. So yeah, then again I should probably relocate briefly again. Oh that's so bad. Yeah. That was bad, I'm not trying that uh, I think again. So yeah, I think that's my cue to uh, at least have a break. Uh, if I'm not uh, back on later today, I'll for sure will be back on tomorrow at the same time, right? Like eight o'clock, nine o'clock a.m. Central European time. So thank you all for uh, watching and uh, thank you for the new followers. And uh, I'll follow you on the YouTube, uh, Lordy and. Uh, Take care and have a nice day. See you later, guys.